Kim. And I'm Daryl. We're some days here. This is Princess. We got some new furniture. We want to update you on it. We got it in, got it put together. We also want to see if you guess which camera was the uh, Eagle 4K. But come on back, see if you guessed right. What's up with the camera and how many people got it right and how many people got it wrong? Actually, every one of y'all got it right. Good it job. Camera number three. Camera number three it was. That's the Eagle 4K camera. We've been using it. It's easy to use. It's got a waterproof case. Man, we can put it under water. Uh, I don't know what to say. It, it's 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 basically easy. If you can use a GoPro, you can use this. The directions are simple. It's basically plug and play, and away you go. So, uh, if you like this camera, and it's, I don't know how much it was. Under 100 bucks. It's under 100 bucks. And what, 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 with uh, all the attachments. What Fluid Form's going to do for you is they're going to give you 15% off. I'll put a link down below, and I'll also put their website down there. That you can go on to Amazon, you get 15% uh, percent off for the first week uh, after this video airs to get you a discount. So if you're looking for a camera that's not real expensive, that you maybe want to do some underwater shots or some outdoor shots, and you're afraid that if it gets damaged, hey man, you're only out maybe 75, 80 bucks or whatever it is. So you know I'm going to use it a lot more underwater, that's for sure. So. Check the link out below. Check out Fluid Form. We appreciate them sending this. It's going to really be a good arsenal. Oh, yeah. Um, I love the picture. I mean, the picture really is good. Yep. To me, I mean, our, I know our GoPros are getting older and stuff, but this right here has got a much better picture on it yeah. to me. So check it out. I love it. Thank you, uh, Fluid Thank Form, you for again. sending that. We appreciate it. We're going to use that a lot. And we may actually get, get another one. Yep. All right, so let's talk furniture. Kim, tell them, tell them about the furniture here and what decisions you made. You want to This right here is the 70-inch Rec Pro reclining couch. It's not the electric one. It's just the handheld one that you pull up and recline in. Um, it's in the chestnut, and it was very simple to put together. I mean, anybody can, can do this. It comes in three boxes. It comes in each one of the chairs comes in a section, and the center console comes in a section. I picked all the boxes up myself. I brought it in the RV myself. So, you know, it may take two people, but I got it in here. So it wasn't really that big deal. Of course, Kim helped me get it up through the door. But it was simple. Fit through the door without any problem whatsoever. So don't think. Well, we took it out of the boxes to come through the That's door. That's right. Because we didn't want the boxes in here and stuff. So they the boxes fit. wouldn't fit. That's correct. So. And all you do is snap them together on the side. I mean, that's a little tricky as yep. far as being able to see it and get down there and hook it together. You have to get a flashlight and stuff. But I mean, five minutes for me to yep. hook up. You'll figure and it out. And put on the back little cover thing. Yeah, so it's just a regular recliner. They slip down over the brackets and they click in there. Yeah, so, I was talking about the, the covers on the back. Oh, where, yeah. Where it does it. But I'm telling you what, it to me, this thing is some comfortable. Yep. I think you only need to be what three or four inches away from the wall. So three inches is the wall. So you can get it real close in. It's going to be all the way in here where our slide, both of our slides yeah. come in. Yeah, it'll we'll be able. To, it it'll be able to pass through it. So. Stand up so we can see the whole thing. Yeah. So it's show got the center console. Look, show them right there when you um, recline the whole it's thing. It's got back. the deal in here. It doesn't have the handles on the side. Recline it back. Slides all the way back. And I mean, you can see how close we are. Yeah. So. So it fits in weather rather well. The chestnut is really a good color. I really like it's this color. Got a big lumbar support. I'm gonna have to break this in because yeah, I have, it's kind of. I got bad posture, so after I yeah. sit in it a little while, it gets tweaked, but it gives me a reason. But it's comfortable, and it, I don't sweat in it. It doesn't stick to you. I like it. It's got a good finish to it. I just, I hope it holds up. But it's built really. 
really tough as far as I know. Yeah. Now this unit here cost about what? 950 bucks. Yeah, so we paid full price right off of Amazon. Three day ship, I think it was, wasn't it? Yeah, but I mean, it was directly shipped from Rep Pro. So yeah. I mean, it's, it's not like, I mean, we've ordered it from Amazon, but it's actually Rep Pro because we get a discount with Amazon because of our, yep. the way that we bill and charge and do everything. That's right. Pay for things. So, um, not charge. Well, we use the get, Amazon Prime have, card and you right, get your Right, you get 5% off, which is the same thing you got there, but it actually was cheaper to buy it on Amazon, so that's why we did that. But again, we're looking for furniture. You know RV furniture, the stuff that comes in it, it's just, it just Uncomfortable. not... Uncomfortable. It's just not functional, and, and it just doesn't last. The, no. the chair was made well, but the material that it was made of was no good. Yep. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk around, grab the camera, I'm going to show you what Kim has done. And we may and change this up. So <laughs> I'm fixing to paint. I'm not going to paint the wood. I'm going to paint the walls. Okay. And I'm taking all the valances down with all the stuff and putting some shades and stuff in here. I cannot take it no more. So Kim's put this chair over here. She's got a, nut, a table over there. We're probably going to get rid of this one. We're just making sure to see what we want to do with it. We want to repurpose that to somebody. I just don't want to throw it in the dumpster. But this is the way she's got it going so far. So that slide will come in. You know, this slide over here will come in. So I think it's going to work very well. So yeah. uh, I, I think it's going to meet our needs. Um, but uh, I know uh, old Tito, Tito said he liked it. Y'all give a shout out to Tito, you know. Um, that's uh, RVing with Tito. Go to his channel, tell him Daryl and Kim says hi. That, uh, we got the same rec pro that they did, so I thank him for putting that video out. Sometimes you don't know <laughs> what's out there until right. you see somebody. It was either do between that and the um, the Thomas Payne. They're they're two of the RV ones that we were looking at, but actually the Thomas Payne was a lot more expensive than this one. I'm not sure, but I mean even Tito said that this one was actually better. So yeah. even, even though he has the one that's the you know the electric refining and all that stuff but we don't need all that nope. and all of this is something else that you got to hook up to the inverter and everything when you're boondocking so we just decided to go with the regular old hand when that way it can't break yep um again we're full-time rvers some of you may have known us from rv adventure tv we changed the name over to some days here so don't forget to like and subscribe down there and hit that bell so you can get notified we're going to start putting some more videos out here we're getting everything geared up, ready to start putting them out on a regular basis. Hopefully two a week now. Um, again, I want to thank Fluid Form for the Eagle 4K. Uh, living full-time in an RV, you got to be comfortable. And doing videos, you got to have camera gear that you can put videos out so y'all can watch them. And actually, I mean, like we were saying, you know, it's a good one just to have. But, I mean, actually, that right there is just as good, in my opinion, as the GoPro. I mean, it's... You get all the accessories with it. I mean, yep, it's, it comes, really, it's really a I'll, nice I'll camera. A, I'm I'll, impressed. I'll put a clip in here with the, the, the accessories that comes with it. But we some of the go... It. No, I yeah. filmed it, but I haven't put oh, it in okay, the last okay, video. Okay, okay. I'm sorry. But, uh... We like it. Hey. Like I said, I mean, I, w I would definitely take another one. So, I mean, it's not a big deal. I mean... All right. Well, until next time... We're some days here. That's right. Stop the madness. Start the adventure. Y'all take care, guys. Go Zags. <laughs> Go LSU.